I imagine him secretive, very calm, reserved, <laughs> somewhat awkward even. Well, I don't know. I've just heard that he's a major analyst. Oh, really? But how do you know? <sighs> Believe it or not, I was in analysis. You? No way! Who could have guessed? Well, guess again. It's me. How did it work exactly? Well, that's very, very personal. Why do you ask? You're not going to. No, of course not. No. I help them, but you know, I won't do it anymore. I promise, never again. But, but what did Shrink say to you, for example? Did he give you advice or...? Above all, no. Advice could be fatal. Fatal? So, uh, he talked about himself then? Never. Are you crazy or what? It would no longer be an analysis. It would be a relationship. A relationship? So, so what happened then? Not much. Almost nothing. Not much. Almost nothing. Well, sometimes. He would go, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, when he, he felt I just said something very essential, or when I was really blocked, or when I stopped. In the middle of a sentence, mm-hmm. Right in the middle, that would happen. Mm-hmm. Yes, because it was a crucial moment. Mm-hmm. Blocked. Crucial moment. Sometimes he would just repeat a word, one single word from my last sentence. Well, what an effect that had. I'd mull it over night and day. Mm. He would repeat a word. He'd say it very quietly, very neutrally, very softly, so as not to interrupt my flow of thought. A word. By what word? Just a word. Mm-hmm. Just a word. And that's all. No. That's not all. What else? Well, sometimes he would also say, Yes. Yes. Mm, 